Right now at 5.30, a Long Island man under arrest after police say he threatened to shoot up a children's hospital in Queens. Good evening once again. I'm Maurice Dubois. Welcome back to the broadcast. I'm Christine Johnson. The NYPD says the suspect was not only armed when they caught him, but they made another chilling discovery. CBS 2's Andrea Grimes reports police also found a cache of weapons and ammo at his home. These pictures released by police help paint a disturbing picture. Guns, ammo, and bulletproof vests investigators allegedly found in 34-year-old suspect Thomas Saxton's car and home. They say he had threatened to open fire inside Cohen Children's Medical Center on the Queens-Nassau border. Why would you want to do that? It's scary. The NYPD says they got a 911 call around noon on Thursday that Saxton was threatening to shoot people inside the hospital. Sources tell us he had gotten into an argument with his wife and threatened to shoot her. When he left the hospital, police sources say she called 911, fearing he would return and open fire. Investigators say they quickly found Saxton's car nearby with two loaded ghost guns and took him into custody. Ghost guns are untraceable firearms made with parts bought online. Police say they then searched his home on Baisley Avenue in East Rockaway, Long Island, and found an additional cache of weapons and ammo. No one answered when we knocked on his door. Stunned neighbors say Saxton moved in a few years ago with his wife and young daughter, and they largely kept to themselves. Melissa Weish lives across the street. It's shocking that it would happen in a neighborhood like this. It's a small, sleepy town. Saxton is now facing numerous charges, including criminal possession of a weapon and harassment. Outside the Queens County Courthouse, Andrea Grimes, CBS 2 News. And Saxton is expected to be arraigned sometime this evening.